Hi everybody. We're going to do the letter V. We talked about that and today I have something that starts with a V for us to do a little project. The very hungry caterpillar. See the letter V is right there. The very hungry caterpillar. Well, I think we're going to make a caterpillar and then we're going to count how many circles he has on his body. Uh, we can do it one way, Oops, like this. You can take a carton of eggs and you can cut part of it off so that you have let's see, this part. And then you can take some circles, little circles like this, and you can glue them to the top. You could, I have some pipe cleaner. I made the top like that and a smiley face. And there's your caterpillar. Let's see how many circles he's got. One, two, three, four, five, five. All right, now I'm gonna show you a different way to make a very hungry caterpillar. Um, and we're gonna see if we can make 10, okay? I have my little circle here. Oops, there he goes. And I put some ovals. Actually, this is kind of an oval shape, too. And on the uh, storybook, which, remember Mrs. Weston read it to Sandro, and I'm sure you have this at home. He's got these little antennas coming up. So you can make that out of paper if you can, or just draw them. So we're going to try to do a pattern today, and we're going to see if we can do ten. This is what we... Let me do that. Okay, I got everything. All right, so I'm going to start with purple. That's one. And yellow. And green. One, two, three. That's my pattern, okay? So if we're going to start our pattern over again, we're going to start with purple again. Here comes another purple. Purple. What comes next? <gasps> You're right, yellow, yes. Let's see, Clara, can you figure out what comes next? Purple, yellow, green, purple, yellow. Yep, and Dylan said it too. Green, you're right, one, two, three, four, five, six. We have to start our pattern over again. Let's see, Jack, you're right, purple. And Eleni said purple, too, because I know that's her favorite color, one of, one of her favorite colors, right? Let's see. Who knows what comes next? That's right. Wyatt. Yellow. I think that's your favorite color, maybe. I don't know. Wow, we have purple, yellow, green, purple, yellow, green, purple, yellow. This is Jack's favorite color, I know. Michael said it. Green. Oh my goodness, I'm running out of paper here. Let's see if we have enough space. Do we have room for one more? Purple, yellow, green. Purple, yellow, green. Purple, yellow, green. Yes! Who said that? Mila! Purple! I know that's one of your favorite colors. Now, I have a new kind of marker here, my crayon, pointy crayon marker. And we're going to make, let's see if we can get a little closer. We're going to make a nose and a mouth. Can you see that? And then I'll, I'll show you our picture. He's got little prickles on top. And he's got these little legs on the bottom. So let's see how we're going to do that. Make some prickles on top. Woo! Sometimes a very, very fuzzy caterpillar, right? And then you can make little legs like that. All right. Then we have to count how many circles we were able to get on our paper. My goodness. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we made it to ten. 
Yay! So that's our very hungry caterpillar with 10 circles. Here's our egg carton caterpillar with one, two, three, four, five circles. This didn't have a pattern. But if you wanted to make more, you could start over with black and red and green and blue and pink, a black and red and green and blue and pink. You could do a pattern however you want. If you don't have colored paper, you could just do it with crayons or markers. You can make circles to make your caterpillar, all right? So have fun with your caterpillar project and make sure you count them. See if you can do 10, right? You're not gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're gonna go one, two, each one gets a a touch, right? You're gonna do it one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bye. Have fun.